Can I take questions from the floor? As soon as you have a question, just raise your hand and we'll come to it. But that flip side is valid, actually. That, but in India, you know, we are not even close to getting to the flip side. So do you think we should at least aim at... So uh, I have to say, as you know, I'm a little bit of an outsider because I left India when I was 19. That's in why you're unbiased. Uh, you could say I'm unbiased or perhaps I, would, I have a different set of biases. Right. So uh, one thing I'd like to say is that, you know, I don't think progress can happen without science and technology, but I don't think science and technology can initiate progress by itself. Uh, and that's because science and technology don't exist in a vacuum. They exist within a broad social culture. Uh, I have to say, you know, a couple of years ago, I gave a talk about what is rational thinking and evidence-based uh, knowledge, which is what science is. And I argued against things like astrology and homeopathy. And I got a lot of criticism. And we have to remember, this is a country where politicians consult astrologers to make important decisions. They, you know, go to temples and, you know, rather than thinking about the problem. And uh, you, need, you need both. The other thing is that countries like Japan and the US were economically advanced first before they became so, at the forefront of science. So, so they have to go hand that. in hand. It, it, it's not that science can necessarily lead the way. Do you believe in God? I personally don't. Here I am on national television. <laughs> <laughs>